first thrown back, retract. Strong back lower has started. Stage one locks, load is complete. Well, good morning everyone and welcome here to the launch pad and our live launch coverage of SpaceX Starlink 9-10. Launching from Slick 4E at Vandenberg Space Force Base in California. If it's your first time here, though, welcome. My name is Zach. I'm the founder and host here at the launch pad. And here at TLP, it's our mission to inform and inspire the explorers of tomorrow because we believe that space is better together. As I said, you're looking at a live view from Slick 4E at Vandenberg Space Force Base, where Falcon 9 Booster 1081 is preparing to go for its 11th flight after previously supporting NASA Crew-7, CRS-29, NRL 186, Earth Care, Transporter 10, PACE, and four previous Starlink missions. On board are 20 Starlink V2 Mini and direct-to-cell satellites, with 13 of them being those direct-to-cell. We did have backup opportunities today till 1.26 a.m., a smaller window there, uh, but they are, uh, sorry, 1.26 a.m. local time, uh, but they are locked in for liftoff at 10.14 p.m. local time, or just 1 minute 45 seconds from now. If you haven't yet, take a moment, engage that like button, share it at the stream, invite people to join us, and let's see that go, no, go in the chat from all of you. If you're a TLP member, don't forget to use those custom TLP launch emotes. We will be following along through first stage landing and second stage parking orbit. The next major call out will be when Falcon 9 takes over the count at that one minute mark and then the go final go for launch from launch after at T minus 45 seconds. Let's listen for the call outs. Falcon 9 is in startup. LD is go for launch. T minus 30 seconds. T minus 15 seconds. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, ignition. And lift off Falcon 9. 
the SpaceX, so start away. Vehicle is pitching downrange. Stage one propulsion is nominal. And Falcon 9 now carrying 20 Starlinks to low Earth orbit. T plus 36 seconds into flight. That first milestone in the timeline will be max Q at 1 minute 7 seconds. That's the peak mechanical stress that will occur. Power and telemetry are nominal. That's coming up here in about 15 seconds. That'll be immediately followed about a minute and a half later by Miko, or main engine cutoff. First and second stage separation, MVAC engine start. Falcon 9 grid, is supersonic. Grid fin deploy and fairing deployment. Next Q. And back chill. Vehicle is following a nominal trajectory. Main engine cut off. Stage separation confirmed. MVAC ignition. Fairing separation confirmed. Both vehicles are following nominal trajectories.
both vehicles continue to follow nominal trajectories. Stage one is your brain. Stage one is your brain shut down. Stage one FTS is saved. And Falcon 9 booster 1081 preparing to conduct a autonomous landing on the drone ship. Of course, I still love you station downrange in the Pacific Both vehicles Ocean. vehicles continue to follow nominal trajectories. The second stage will continue under power till 8 minutes 38 seconds into flight where it will put into its initial parking orbit. It will conduct one more burn, 53 seconds, 22 seconds into flight for one second to get into its finalized deployment orbit with Starlink deployment set one hour, 15 seconds into the mission. SpaceX will confirm, confirm deployment via their social media. We're preparing for that landing burn. The next launch we have on the schedule is Falcon 9 Starlink 6-69 launching on Sunday evening. Uh, or late afternoon from Slick 40 at Cape Canaveral, so we hope you'll join us here. You can stay tuned on the latest developments of the launch schedule at tlpnetwork.com slash launches. Stage one, lighting burn. Stage two is entered terminal guidance. Stage one, lighting light deploy. Stage one landing is confirmed. And there you can see Falcon 9 landing on that drone ship, waiting for confirmation of Seco 1. We'll see that speed kind of slow down in the bottom right corner uh, as it uh, arrives at that initial parking orbit. And there we have confirmation of SECO-1. Falcon 9 will continue on its journey to, as I said, to that Starlink deployment. Starlink deployment set to occur one hour, 15 seconds into flight. Make sure you for confirmation of deployment. If you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button so you never miss another live launch coverage. I get a huge thank you to all of you. We are so excited to have 500,000 subscribers uh, earlier, well, I guess technically yesterday for us on the Space Coast. Make sure you stay tuned to our social media. We're going to be doing some uh, giveaways and dropping brand new merch, not only for 500K, but Flight 6, uh, Starship, and some other stuff. So make sure you stay tuned to that. And join us over on the TLP Discord. That's where our community is in between streams. Love to see. That's going to do it from our TLP Space Coast studio. My name's Zach. Next time, because space together. Good night or good morning.